Hi all. Welcome to Uru Tutorial. Today, in this video, we will be discussing on the Python model constraints in Order 15. So, Uru helps you to set constraints to variants uh, which we can perform using Python and model constraints. In Uru, Python constraints are specified along with the methods. So, in Uru, we use uh, constraints which are defined along with a method that created within a function known as constraints that is we use it a decorator called api.constraints to set the constraints within our model so let's uh, get into the video so currently we have a model auto.tutorial and in which we have different fields such as name fee instructor id is prime decreation set description tutorial etc let's say i need to add in constraints to the name field uh, which checks uh, the length of the name that is I need to add an validation which checks whether the um, name field contains at least four characters so let's do that so for that first we need to import the API from the auto package that is I have already imported that is from auto import API and to return a validation error I have imported from auto.exceptions import validation error so next I will add let's say API dot constraints please do keep in mind that it doesn't contain t that it's just api.constraints that is c o n s t r e i n s and there is no t in that so as i'm adding the constraint for the name field i'll just say api.constraint uh, the field name next i'll add the function name that is let's say check underscore name and within that itself Okay. Next, uh, in order to avoid the singleton error, if there are multiple records, I'll just say for rec in self. Next, we need to check the um, length of the name for that. Uh, let's say if alien of rec dot name is less than four. I'll just say raise validation error. I'll just add the text as on tutorial name should be at least four characters. Okay, now we'll restart the service. After restarting the service, we'll just <coughs> um go to our model this is our model uh, tree view I shall create a record let's say um, for the current being I'll just set no tutorial and the instructor dash and a date and uh, let's say I'll set the fees at 10 just prime I'll save the record okay now the record is saved now I'll create a new record and I'll just say set the total name as new that is its length is three on saying this we can see that a validation error is returned that is the total name should be at least four characters that is as you have said the validation as a, um, the length of the name should be i mean if it is less than four characters in, in the uh, length of the tutorial name is less than four it will run a validation error okay similarly we can set uh, the api dot constraints for multiple fields and this currently as we have set is for a single field now we'll set it a let's see i'll just add one more field here sorry okay now let's say we'll add another condition i mean another validation check here that is uh, we'll check whether the uh, name and description is same that is for a tutorial the name and the description should not be the same so let's see if rec uh, dot name equals equals rec dot description raise validation error let's say tutorial name and description let's say it's it should be different 
that is in the earlier case we have said the api dot constraints for a single field now we have called two fields inside the constraints decorator and inside that i'm checking whether the name and the descriptions are equal and if they are both equal we should return another validation error that is the tutorial name and description should be different now let's restart the service Let's got this. I'll create another record. Let's see. Test. I'll set the instructor as visual. I'll set the, the description as test also. Now, if I save the record, we can see that another validation error is uh, returned. That is, tutorial name and description should be different. Okay, that is, whenever we give the name and the description the same value the uh, constraints check for the condition if whether they are same that is if rec.name is equal to equal to rec.description we return a validation error similarly if we give the uh, name with a less than four characters the other validation error will be returned also uh, there are some limitations for using the uh, constraints to creator that is the uh, constraints decorators will not be supported, let's say, uh, along with the related fields. That is, they can be only be applied to uh, simple fields. Let's say, as we have a field called uh, instructor ID, let's say, if you need to add a creator, I mean, uh, for the constraints using the instructor.acreator.name field, it's not possible. That is, the API.constraints does not accept dot regions inside their arguments. It can only be used on simple fields. Also, uh, it should be applied only on fields that are included in the create and write call because uh, if the field which is not contained in the view, it will not trigger a call to the Python functions. So uh, this is all about the uh, Python constraints and order 15. I hope you have understood the video. Thank you.